Hello everyone and welcome back to Elden Ring and the first thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to move the time along. Uh, past time until morning. So I can explore. Oh that's, that's awesome. That is so good. That looks so good. Right, okay. Um, I never actually explored this shack over here, did I? Because I fell down that gap. Anything in here? Shack of the Rotting. I stand here, I should be safe. Alleviates Scarlet Rot Buildup and Cures Rot Ailment. I need to equip that for this area, definitely. That one. Katana Forged of Glintstone, masterpiece of a Selian swordsmith. Light enwreaths the blade when sheathed, explaining its Moonvale moniker. Acid Spray Mist. Thorfrost Bolluses, Stimulating Bolluses. Reserving policies. Oh, an immunizing horn charm. Said to be a budding horn, the ancestral followers believe that the horns of a long lived beast continue to bud like antlers over and again until the beast one day becomes an ancestral spirit. Raises immunity that might be worth having in this area. Clarifying battle. Focus governs resistance to sleep and madness. Um, I should really equip those bottles. Use FP to scatter sparks in a wide area. Why not? Okay. So, my plan now is to follow the road, basically. So, I'll just follow the road all the way around. I think the thing is there. Yeah. Avoiding this middle area here for now. I will explore it at some point, but for now I'm just going to follow the path. Stick to the road. Oh crap. <laughs> Try sorcery. There are loads of them. Oh, really? Nice. Oh, just missed. Oh, get off. Nonsense. lot of them. Damn you. I like this jump attack, eh? I kind of feel like maybe I shouldn't be here now. Like this is the next area of... Maybe I need to go and do something else for a while.
Only 300? Really? I'm surprised at that, considering how many enemies there are around here. I'm surprised at that, considering just how many enemies there are around here. Or how many of them there are. It's a good idea to clear clear out. I kind of feel like maybe I'm supposed to go somewhere else next. <laughs> There's two of them. My summon's gone. This is not good. I was hoping to keep him as a distraction. Really? Yeah. I don't know what happened there. I was shielding. I think it went over my shield somehow. But I don't want to risk anything here because these things can take you out so easily. Is there a chest here? No. Who's there though? Oh. A great sword.
I don't think I've yet found a um, a mimic. Are they even in this game? I'm curious. Giving me a core material. There we go. Is there something down here? Ah, oh, is that how we get down there? Do I really want to even attempt this? I mean, look. He's already shooting at me. <laughs> Stop. Oh, it's a grace. This is why I need to stick to the path. Stick to the path. Bush ahead. I feel like you're right, but I kind of want to walk into it anyway. Something's losing health over there. I don't know what it is. It's poisoned itself or something. This place is horrible. It's genuinely freaking me out, this place. I have to admit, it's... Uh... <laughs> What is this? Oh, okay. <laughs> he's walking into the fire. Or oh, he's spawned in the fire. <laughs> Do you get less runes if they kill themselves like that? I think you do. Oh, look. It's one of them things. Oh, bugger. Dumb. How can you destroy these things then?
There's one there as well. I can avoid them altogether. Oh, come off it. Let's <laughs> go through the wall. That's not fair. It's got to be an easier way to kill these things, because this is quite ridiculous. Hopefully they don't come back. That would be the ideal scenario. But I don't know if that's going to be the case. I think if you can get on top of them, they have a weak spot. How are you supposed to get on top of them? I don't know. You run away like a coward, that's what you do. <laughs> and lining did seem to do quite a bit to it, to be honest. When I hit it in the right spot. Got to be something else here, though.
bugger. <laughs> He's just like, hello. See me. So this is what I mean. I'm trying to um, trying to target. Ah! Oh! <laughs> it was so dumb. That was so dumb. I was just getting so impatient with it. Now everything's going to be respawned. Probably those big things as well. Yeah. No, I'm just gonna run and ignore all this stuff because this is all bullshit. <laughs> this is all bullshit. Oh, hello. I'll take it. Ah, oh, are you serious? <sighs> Nice. I'll take it. Likely tree. Oh. Head ahead. <laughs> oh, God. I'm going to be another NPC. Likely arm. Um, then behold fire. Ah. Okay. Head ahead. I get it. <laughs> what on earth is that? If that. The tricks and bronze shield pitting the face of a fire giant several times leap from its open mouth. The dreadful visage and burning flames are designed to remind one of the horror of facing a fire giant. In other words, this shield has an instructional function. Ready the shield, then spray violent jets of fire from the tongues, protruding for its hold to continue spray. This skill can be used while walking. That is awesome. Is that an actual... That's a shield. Yeah. Wow. And he's 44 strength. 44 strength. Wow. I know I need to get out of here <laughs> without dying. You are exactly where I need to be.
Well, I'm getting out of here. I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> I'm done with this area. Is that Grace I see beyond here somewhere? I think on the other side of this wall. What is this? <gasps> oh, wow. You can use the bird's eye telescope found in various areas to get a bird's eye view of the terrain in the direction that the telescope is facing. How have I never used this before? So there's a tree, there's a shack up there. Let's head up there. There's a tower there. There's a tree up there. I'm not sure how to get to that. Guaranteed there's an item in there. Okay. <laughs> Whatever. Twenty five nine. Let's see if I can mix a different physic. sure if black flame is actual fire does it count as fire oops I didn't mean to do that maybe I don't really need to use those anymore stick those on for a while I assume it does count as fire. Um, but now I want to check out... Is it up here? No, damn. Where is it? can't really tell from here. Over there. Is 
Let's go. Oh, that was close. I was not paying attention. I guess this might be a good way to test. So, 561. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oi, get off. Play in. Whoa. <laughs> he launched himself. There is a way across. Just. I think I need to go horseback there. So there is. Ah, oh, we're here now. Oh, that's the... Ah, uh, that makes sense. That makes sense. Is there a map up here, then? Because it looks like there is a map there. If I can grab that. And then we're going to have a look at that shack. Yeah. And there's a dragon. I will leave that alone. <laughs> dragon barrow. So that's, yeah. Messing around with you. Well, now, anyway. I should have rested. Damn it. Wouldn't leave me alone. I was quite happy to leave you be. Now all your friends are going to die. If I can hit them.
Wow. Go to sleep. These goats are going to beat my downfall, though. One more of them and I'll have a level. Let's go and kill one more. At least they have one big weak spot. Really? Oh. Uh, where was I? Just got disturbed. That's right, I was just having a glimmer around. Ah, there's a merchant. Just want to make sure I've got enough runes to level up. Although, to be honest, probably just about to spend a load of stuff with the merchant, so... Just the wrong button. Oh, bugger. This is a war, war shot. Wasn't expecting that to run away <laughs> and have that much health. So, sky shot, archery, sky shot, not skill shot. Archery skill performed from a low stance. Ready the bow, then fire an arrow high up into the air for arcing so as to strike the enemy from above when it comes down. Nice. Let's have a look around first, make sure there's nothing here. Oh, look, there's one of them over there. Don't miss again. Oh, my God. What's going on? <laughs> Let's go and get this guy. That'll give me just enough, hopefully, to... There's another one.
Yeah, we'll leave those. All right. <laughs> How do these merchants get around without getting murdered by everything? That's what I want to know. Right, that should allow me to use this thing. Oh, it's nearly there. Nearly. One five three one four two. I just need to level it up, Billy. Which I will see what I can do. Well, there's been an age since I've seen a customer. How can I help here at the end of the earth? Oh, these are the things I was looking for. Sacrificial twig. Have a safe journey. Is there nothing else here? Is this literally all there is? I was expecting like a painting or something. What has it given me here then? So... There's a hidden cave in the town of Celia. Look beyond the graveyard at the precipice. Town of Celia. Look beyond the graveyard at the precipice. Old Gale in Caelid houses a gateway that leads to Redmain Castle. Celia. Well, we'll come back to that. I want to level up the seal and then that's it. I'm, I'm done for today. Um, so I want to head over to the War Councillor, E.G. And I'm, I'm hoping he will have, I'll be able to buy well, what I need I to level it further. Oh, he only does these. I did not realise that. Take it you've heard of the eternal city of Noxtella. Well, it has a twin known as Nokron, the other eternal city. After years of expeditions, we've determined the location of Nokron by going underground through the well in the mistwood of Lingrave. You can see Nokron up above, only we failed to find a path leading to the city. Blythe's made a good go of it, but I'm afraid this has him quite stumped. To be honest, I'm not sure where to go from here. Blythe is Lady Rani's stepbrother. Rani's mother, Queen Renala, approved of him, and they played like siblings from childhood. They were always happy to have me tag along as well. When Lady Rani renounced her flesh and chose the dark path of Empyrean, Blythe and I swore allegiance as vassals. But none of us will ever forget our earliest days together. Promise to look after Blythe for me, will you? The man is honest to a fault. But fortunately, now he has you. Blythe. I take it you've heard well. After years by going underground, only Blythe's, to be honest. Okay. Uh, um. I need smithing stone three. Damn it. I don't think I can buy them. I might be able to buy some from the round hold. Round table hold. No. Damn it. Well, that's poo-pooed my idea of using that talisman just yet. I may just look up 
where the next ball bearing is that um, allows me to purchase the next level of smithing stones. Maybe I'll do that on the next episode. So I'll catch you then. Thanks for watching and I'll see ya. Bye. <laughs>